Hello everybody! Welcome back to Farming Simulator 19. I'm Tenacious Viking, your farmer host. Welcome back to the solar farm. I have uh, some solars growing out there. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Whatever. I uh, got some money. I've gotten some things done. Uh, let's uh, take a look around and... Uh, uh, okay, yeah, we're harvesting 21, which I believe is all, <laughs> all right now. I've been running at 120 just to get this to get everything right, you know? I mean, why not, right? Yeah, so 22 is still being planted, but part of it's already ripe because I've been running so fast. I should check and see what... Yeah, see, it still says those need plowing, which drives me crazy. I'm going to plow them because I need to see below there what needs to be done. Uh, you know, yeah, so. <sighs> Whatever. So I'm all ready to, uh, to harvest some soybeans. I, I have some on hand, but not a, not a truckload, and the price isn't very good anyway, so I'm in no big hurry. But, um, I just want to keep keep doing it, keep at it. All right, okay, we've finally got finished planting, so I'm going to run this back to the farm. Probably get run over by a car. Nope. Okay. Whoa, stop. Oh, my gosh. I have a little bit of lag for some reason. That's weird. I head back to the farmyard and uh, show you what... Uh, I don't know that I've done a lot there. Um... What did I do? Hmm. Like I bought. Well, I bought a couple more uh, solar uh, panels. <clears throat> I was gonna look and see how much I'm making each each day. Uh, Cause it's in, at 120, it builds up fast, you know. Which means we should be able to buy a building or two. Look at this. This this doesn't even pop in until I get the, the the garage in the back pops in right away. But now the the shed did, and there comes the uh, storage. <laughs> I don't know why that garage pops in so so fast, but the other stuff does not. Yeah, I'm going to have to um, move that header, and I'm not sure where to put it. Um, hmm. Don't know. Um, I do have several things I want to put in place here. I want to work on my uh, the road around that uh, garage, too. What? Oh yeah, I've got it. I've got that end open where I keep the combine. <clears throat> this is where I'm going to put the house, and I have almost enough money to do that. So maybe I should do that while I can. I don't know how often I'll have that much money. <clears throat> we need the four hundred and seventy thousand dollar manor house. Uh, I'm trying to think if there's anything else that I really need to um, to do more farming. I mean, I need to buy. I want to buy a piece of land. I I have a. I have to check and see if. Uh, I'm in the wrong place to do that. Okay. Uh, I have to check and see if there is a place. To sell milk because I'm not sure that there is on this map. Oh yes, there is, and there's a pretty good price. Milk sell point. Okay, sweet. All right, that's what I wanted to know. Because as you know, what I'd like to do um, is I'd like to buy this field too uh, for one million six hundred ninety-three thousand dollars give up the field for for this part right here and divide it into two separate fields and then with this area uh create a uh, as automated a livestock farm as i possibly can i think that's going to be kind of fun i'm trying it on another map to be perfectly honest and it's kind of grindy uh because turning this into a field uh or giving this up as a field, you have to take that dumb roller all over. 
So I'm thinking maybe I'll just plant grass here and see how that looks. Um, because I think when I put stuff on top of it, it's going to disappear anyway, and I can create a path in it, I believe. So I might try that. I don't know. Anyway, uh, because I'm running at such a fast speed, I'm going to slow things down to about 15. It's uh, nighttime already. Um, but I think since I have the money, I ought to get the house in place, which means I have to sell the other one. So I had better go and sleep and the trailer for the last time. Oh, before I do that, I was going to see how much I am making in a day. Now, uh, 327, I think it's going to be more than that by the end of this day, because uh, I've added the two since then, I believe. So, that's pretty good. That should be 350, 360, something like that. All right, let's see, see what happens. Hmm, 341 property income. Now, did that come at the end of the day? How come I'm getting some every hour and some at the end of the day? I don't quite understand that. But let's take a look at the... Um, okay, 341 is, is all. Hmm, I thought it'd be more than that. Okay, I'd like to get... Well, I like being at least 300,000 a day. That way it means I can buy two more... Um, solar panels if I if, if if I'm in that mood but I'm not let me see how the um, harvest is coming 65% here I'm done with that uh, I got uh, I did I is this the no this is the uh, that's the case so I put the Massey on the trailer well that was silly <laughs> There, ah, I got a big Massey Ferguson 8727. I think it's, um, what is it? Well, I mean, it's not that big, but it's big enough. Yeah, 300 horsepower. It's just sweet. It's sweet. Oh, well, not that much more than the John Deere, but a little bit more. So, I almost want a bigger, um, Boy, where'd he go? I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get out of the shadows here. Um, almost want a bigger planter, but I like that planter a lot, so I'll probably just put up with it as is. All right, let's. Oh, uh, let's see. Where did we have? Yeah, I got the little uh, Mahindra. I don't think I had that before, and that's. I got that parked in the middle here, out of the way, so I can park tractors in on both sides here if I need to. Um, but let's. Um, Got to get this road made around here and, and get this looking nice. And also, see if I can undo that shrub. I don't know. I might cut this off too. We've got plans for right here. Oh yeah, we do. Somewhere. All right, let's buy a house, shall we? Oh boy, this is so exciting. <gasps> no, before I do that. I have to actually go and sell the old one because it won't let me have two houses at once. I gotta go through 85 million of these things to get to it, I think. There we go. Okay, I'm gonna sell this. Boop. 16,000. Wow. Okay, so I now am homeless. <laughs> uh. All right, let's see how this fits here. Thinking about it. Hello, hello, there we go. Uh. Um, I want it to be here, but I want it to be like so. Oh, look at that, it's got nice trees. Um, I'd kind of like it to be like here. I, I, in my other game, I put it way back here and, you know, nothing matches up that way. You can, I guess I can make my own drive or a sidewalk, 
uh, out to the road or make the road a little tighter there. I don't know. Now I'll make a sidewalk out to it. I'll put it right there. All right. Well, that took care of a lot of money right there, didn't it? But look what we got. The only thing I don't like is, uh, I mean, I can, I'm going to have a little car at some point here and that I can just drive up here and stop. Um, I wish I could, I wish they had a little sidewalk I could do. Uh, oh, I got that too, but I don't think that helps either. I think the only place you can sleep is right here. Um, so, yeah. So I'd love to be able to choose, you know, to go up here once in a while and sleep up here, but nope. I don't think that, I don't think it works. Nope, one sleeping place. Because this would be a nice place to open a show from here. But you, you can't even get far enough ahead to get that dumb thing, that effect out of there. So, yeah, whatever. Uh, come on. Here we go. And then you can't you can't do anything here either. Oh, I'm on standing on the railing. Standing on the railing. So it's a it's a nice house. It looks nice. Uh, it's fun to have, but um, it's not. I, I wish it had more options to it for that for that house kind of house. It looks really nice though. I like that a lot, a lot, and a lot. Uh, let's also, since we're spending money wildly, um, I don't know if this is under miscellaneous or under. Someday I will have a square bale barn, I think, uh, or direction I'm going to go, and definitely a forage mixer. like to get the orchards. I haven't tried those yet. I have no idea what they're like. Um, I might even go so sad as to just buy a silage station and buy my silage uh, rather than make it because it's such a pain. Um... Okay, we got uh, these uh, bale sheds are kind of cool. You can just back up and unload and then load up again. You have to get the right ones, though. Still want to do some construction somewhere, but I'm not sure where. Just for the fun of it. A fertilizer silo, a, a gas tank. I don't even know where the gas is. And it's okay, it wasn't here. It's, uh, it's, it's, it's under sheds. Of course it's under sheds. Don't know if I'm going to need any of these. I don't plan to have that a lot of equipment. Um, don't like these at all. They, I, I don't know. I have a thing about them. Um, my, my experience with sheds of that design are not good. This is what I want. So let's see what we can do here. Uh, oh, I probably put it right where I need to. Yeah, I probably parked right where I need to put this thing. I don't know if I actually want this right. Um, <clears throat> oh, that's the wrong. Is that the wrong direction? Did I go backwards on that? Yep, I did. Of course. I don't. You know, see, I don't know if I want it here or here where the Mahindra is. Probably, I probably want it right here where the Mahindra is. Yeah. I wonder if I can even put it at a little bit of an angle. I could. That looks cool like that, doesn't it? But I gotta, I gotta get out of this and move this stupid Mahendra first because I didn't think of it. Because I'm a dummy. Uh, all right, let's go run over and move this thing out of the way and boss a garage. The nice thing about the garage is it'll hold uh, actually four vehicles. It'll hold this thing. It'll hold um, the, the pickup I have. It'll hold the new one I'm gonna buy, and it'll hold a car too. So I'll park over here sometimes. So there. All right, now let's try that again, shall we? There we go. Um. There we go. That's pretty cool like that, isn't it? I think that looks that looks nice there. Kind of con uh, follows the contour of the... Uh, yeah. Or do I put it over here? Uh, 
could it could look nice right here too. Uh, I could just extend uh, the dirt <laughs> a little bit, or maybe even over here and it'll give me a path into the the garage. I might need that space for something else. I can't imagine what it would be, but I'm gonna put it here. I think just just because. Okay. Uh, how much money do I have left? I think I just made some more. <laughs> or, or it was some. Oh, 214? Yeah. I'm going to do this as well then. Uh, this is something I had planned um, for when I uh, got rid of the, um, the trailer. I don't like all that in my way. Okay, getting close to where I want to be. Here we go. There we go. Now, I did this on my other game, and I, I don't know which was. I think this is the garage door. Is that the door? Yeah, that's the door. Okay. I did this in my other uh, game, and I got too close to this gate, and so I got a conflict between the two. So I think I'm going to try right here and see if that works better. Okay. Let's see how things are going. All right, we got. All right. I might have to move the end right here because I might not be able to get the, the pickup in here. Yeah, it's gonna be tight. Yeah, I. Uh, it, it might. Uh, this might become the home of the Mahindra instead. Or I might get two Mahindras. Who knows? Both fit. I didn't think so. Nope. See, I can't close it. But I'll I'll leave that here for now. Um, I wonder if there's a. Um, there goes the plane. The plane, boss. The plane. Mm -hmm. I wonder if there's a uh, another uh, small vehicle I could. Maybe a small tractor actually. Hmm. I don't know if I could find out a smaller one. May have to drive the Mahindra over. Right now, I gotta unload the harvester. <clears throat> I think I'll be uh, probably be spending some money. I'd like to have finish another row of um, of uh, solar panels next and then I can start to do some other things um, like buying that and saving up 1.7 million dollars to buy that big plot of land that's gonna keep me busy once I get that really busy really, really busy. so I'll probably off-camera try to uh, try to build up to that point and, uh, and then try planting grass and see how that looks um, before I start my massive livestock operation. All right. Now by turning withering off, I have a luxury of making this stuff get ripe, so I always have something to harvest for you um, without losing it. So... This, uh... Gosh, you know, if I hadn't just bought a house in a garage, this would be a good uh, thumbnail for the uh, for this episode. But nope. <laughs> um, I'm gonna drive this back to the um, to the farm. I have not invested heavily in a lot of car mods because I'm not, you know, I'm not a big car guy. 
I use cars as a way to get from one place to another, uh, not as a substitute for sex. <clears throat> oh, did I just diss a bunch of muscle car guys? <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, not really, but... Uh, okay, I'm going to head over. I don't waste time trying to follow the slow traffic. I just get along here. I like that there's some sides here I could use to... I like this old truck. Um, it just kind of reminds me of back in the day, you know. I will have two more pickups. Um, just a nice black one and then a... Um, I don't know what they call it. One for, uh, for a convoy. <laughs> don't like about these garages is when you get out you're kind of stuck yeah. Let's see okay I guess I can make it all right well that's gonna do it uh, let's, um, let's, uh, let's go over here and get a nice uh, angle on what we accomplished today yeah that looks good I like that sweet Thank you so much for watching. Join me again for Farming Simulator 19. More from the solar farm next time. Welcome new subscribers, and remember, be kind.